Well, you heard from a couple of local players, including Monterey Trail High School alum Jahail Budget. We had a chance to catch up with his high school coach about his growth over the years. Jahail, we had his older brother in the program. Our program is not easy. It's a, it's a hard regimen of uh, discipline and structure and accountability. And uh, he was doing it as a little child. It's awesome to watch the transition of all the years, their progress from a child all the way to a man. Another Monterey Trail High School alum is Andre Crump Jr. This wide receiver comes to UC Davis after some time at San Jose State. Coach Ewing says the sky is the limit for this wide receiver. Andre has national level talent. I mean, in my opinion, Andre is as good as he wants to be. He is nothing can hold Andre back. He's strong. He's everything. He's entirely intelligent. He can pick things up really fast, learn things really quickly. I mean, he has everything you can. He has everything. He has everything. Well, he is everything. Mm -hmm. Monterey Trail alums aren't the only local players. There are spot. 25 players from the greater Sacramento region representing 19 high schools. Yeah. Another school represented is Granite Bay High School, and they have three alums, Evan Tattersall, Zaire Collier, and Benjamin Newman. And we talked to their high school coaches about what it means to see the players they coached playing at the next level. It's really rewarding uh, to, to get to watch the, the young men go on and continue their education and, and continue getting the opportunity to play to play football. Uh, it's obviously a very difficult thing to do and, and not a lot of guys get to do it. So uh, it's it's special for those young men and reflective of the hard work and uh, the, the time that they put in. Have them here at Davis creates that kind of feel that they're still at home and they're and they're and they're playing for the home team. Um, and then for, for Ben and Zaire and Evan to all go to such a great school at, like UC Davis, is, it makes us all very proud.